I'm back and this is another wig tutorial I went to my hair supply store today and I was a little bit disappointed because there's two locations they have two locations out here in Staten Island and one location that I always go to they said the old other location has Outre and all these brands so I said okay let me go to the other location so I went to the other location very disappointed they had like lace front wigs and I don't think I don't I don't think I, I would fit the, the lace front wig just because I have a different forehead I think certain foreheads fit that and being that my hairline is very low it just wouldn't fit me um, so I think I'm just gonna stick to half wigs and they didn't even have outro because I wanted to get a Monica and then I said okay when we look at sensational um, uh, uh, what was it HZ 70 think 61 and they didn't have it so I said okay I go home so they, they showed me another one which I'm going to do today at 70 it's a 7062 and it's a number two because I like to stick with my hair color and number two is like the size eight of shoes everybody's hair is a number two so they didn't have the color of 7061 for me and I'm glad I didn't get 7061 because every time I see somebody with the tutorial they either look like the soul glow commercial remember from coming to America let your soul that it, it looks like that and or it looks like a jerry curl version of Joe Dirt's hair remember Joe Dirt that movie and I'm saying oh I'm glad I didn't get it so I'm gonna stick to Monica looks like I'm just gonna have to order it online because they didn't have what I needed but anyway so I'm just gonna do uh, 70 60 what did I say two okay 70 62 okay and this is what she looks like now when I saw this I was a little bit scared because I'm so used to the you know va va voom curls the nice loose long curls so I was I was really scared but when I tried it on because in my in the um, beauty supply store I know them very well so they let me put it on before I take it home so I'm really ha happy about that my hair is always clean so I'm not one of the dirty heifers waking up now with this hair it's actually heat resistant fibers so you can um, it's, it's safe up to 350 to 400 Fahrenheit as you can see right here so you can curl it when the when you want to so I was like okay that sounds a little bit okay so being that I kind of left a little bit depressed I said okay well this hair I think I'm gonna really like so as you can see I have my wig cap on usually I don't wear a wig cap but the girl at the store said it makes your hair straighter once I condition it and everything and then put this on it makes my front of my hair a lot you know um, straighter because I usually I'm used to you know, like I said, the va va voom half wigs, like I did for the 7045. So I'm I'm gonna try and explore other styles and not be too scared. But right now, mm, I'm sorry, 7061 is not the business. I don't care how much you do with it, it don't look right. So I'm happy I didn't do it. Okay, so I took a little bit of my hair out. Now I'm gonna put it on. All right. Oh, I was like, oh my gosh, what is this girl trying to put on my hair? Because, you know, sometimes people just want to make a sale. I'm like, what does she want to do to my hair? Jeez. So, but when I put it on in the store, I'm like, oh my gosh, I really like it. Right? So, this is how it looks before I do anything. This is how it looks out of the packet. I didn't do anything to it. I just put it on and said, oh, I like it. I'm taking it home. I said, put it in the bag. Throw it in the bag. You know, I said, put it in the bag. So, this is how it looks without it. It's very long. Okay? Don't focus on my titties. But you know what? A lot of times when I see tutorials, they say, oh, it goes past your boob and all this stuff. Everybody have different titty sizes. So, I just say I'm a 36D. So, this is where it comes for 36Ds. It goes past underneath right here. And if I show it from the side that's what it looks like this is very long very long right here my butt is right here I'm not gonna 
stand up, but my butt is right there. So it's a very, very long wig. Okay, so of course, what we're gonna do, lift it up. We're gonna comb it back a bit. And I'm gonna put pins on the sides because I'm going to a baby shower tonight. So I'm gonna actually do something to it. Okay, put the pins on the side. Now what I like to describe this hair as is uh, Miami hair. Cause you know the local Miami girls down there, like the Cuban girls, they have very, very loose, lifeless, just luxurious, soft waves in their hair. So this is what I would call my Miami hair. And I already went to Miami this year, so I was kind of upset that I wish I had this hair. Cause this would have been perfect. Let me get this glare out of your faces. Cause this right here is getting on my nerves. Okay get that out of your way there we go there we are okay so we're gonna get some more hair out because as you can see there we go I don't want to get too much hair out just for the simple fact that I do have dye tips that's growing out okay we're gonna get the of course smoother from black and sassy I don't need to show you what it looks like. Everybody knows what it looks like. I mean, it's the new winter fresh gum. You don't have to show people winter fresh because they know what winter fresh is. So I'm not going to show you. But what I will keep showing you is the L'Oreal hair putty that I use. So usually after I do the hair, the um, smoother, it smoothes out my edges. You see? Now I remind you, I have not permed my hair in months been a couple of months all right so we're gonna put the hair putty on there because it's gonna keep my hair straight the smoother just smooths it out but this right here keeps it at ease and it keeps I'm gonna put a little like I said I told you I love my I love my sideburns they're not crazy long but they're nice and thick and they they just go with me okay there we go all right. There we go. I hope everybody's gonna have a nice weekend. It's supposed to be a really nice weekend, you know. Okay. Now we're gonna push it forward. All right. There we go. All right. Let's. I'm trying to get a good feel for you guys because it's just it's a much different look. See, I like to have things to the side. That's just how I do. I mean, if it's in the front, like in the center, like, you know, you have a center fake illusion part, like the picture, then it will look like this. But it just looks so thin right here, and then it comes down like this, and I don't like that. I like to make it look like it's a local, like I'm a local from Miami. So let's ja, ja, Juno. Oh, there we go. That's better. See, that's just how I am. I just like that beautiful big thick hair okay so let's get I'm gonna get this back again just blend it in okay as you can see it's very very out of bed like you had a really nice night with a special type of person but I really love this hair look at it it's beautiful look at that the feel is it feels like hair. It feels like human hair. Okay, let's, let's make it nicer. All right. Now, what you can do? Oh, you can do a lot with this hair. You definitely can do a lot with it. You know. Okay. Um, if you're going to Miami, you can have your your shades on like this. You know. Aldos. Who goes to Aldos? Everybody goes to the Aldos. I love Aldos. You know. I'm an Aldos Forever 21 type of thing okay it's nice out the sun is out New York okay and this is my um Revlon color stay this one is called pecan pleasure now on black girls for some reason I noticed that it comes out pink it doesn't come out this color it's like a brown color on here it doesn't come out that color but I don't put too much on it because I see too many 
girls my complexion are darker and they put these really really white out looking pink on their lips and it, it just looks crazy so I try to you know minim moderate it just a little bit because it's it certain things that just don't fit people you know so I mean pink is is cute but don't go too light girls black uh, color come on we just know we can't get too light of a color. We can't go crazy. You can't go neon. Just make it look natural. You know? Just because Becky does it doesn't mean, you know, Shaniko can do it. Do it in moderation. So this would be my Miami look. If I had, if I was going to Miami today. But this is what it would look like. And this is, look, totally different from her. You know, usually it don't really even look like the picture, but this is the number two. This is 70, uh, 62. I don't know why the girl cut it off. She cut it off right here. I don't know why. So I have to rip this off. Okay? That's it right there. But yeah, I love this. It, it remind, you know who it reminds me of too? Uh, Melanie Fiona. See? So, let's get a good look at it. Mm, how you doing? It's really nice. See? really nice and flowy and just gorgeous um i'm gonna try it up in the next tutorial i'm um, just showing you how i will rock it if it's just like a nice summer day all right so check out my next tutorial